All right, Misha, thank you. This weekend, the Vikings are coming to Philadelphia for the NFC Championship game, so we wanted to know what they might bring with them. Right, like what sort of words we may hear when the Vikings fans are at the link or what Eagles fans might hear in Minnesota in a couple of weeks during the Super Bowl. And Pat Gallen is here with a little help. You betcha, Jim. <laughs> All right, I have to work on the accent. But I know someone who has it down. Our Minnesota native and Vikings slash Eagles fan, Misha Johnson, helps us get acclimated with Minnesota as the Vikings invade the link on Sunday. So we know the Eagles are taking on the Vikings this weekend here at Lincoln Financial Field, but we want to get a sense of what happens in Minnesota and who better to tell us than Minnesota native Misha Johnson. Hi, Thank Pat. you, Misha. Yes, you're so welcome. So this is going to be really interesting because a lot of people don't actually know what happens in Minnesota. Yeah, well, the vernacular that they use out there is a little bit different than in the northeast section of the country. So I've got a couple of terms I want to throw by you. I want you to tell us as Philadelphians, yes. what exactly these terms are. You ready? Okay, this is weird, but All right. yes. All right, maybe you've heard this one because they did it at the Vikings game against the Saints. Skull. What is so, skull? Skull is skull. derivative. It's a, from a Swedish word that's cheer. So cheers, so it's kind of like skull. It, that's what they're basically saying. That they is just correct. might not have the Swedish accent in it, but it is Danish, it is. Norwegian, or Swedish for cheers or good health. Yes. A salute or toast. What is hot dish? Doesn't sound <laughs> too appetizing. What's hot dish? Okay, why doesn't it? First of all, why does that not? It sound just has like a weird good? ring to it. Hot dish. Okay, you guys. So a hot dish is something that you'd make. It's usually made with a mushroom base and a cream based uh, soup on the bottom, but it always has tater tots baked on top. But then you usually put fish or meat into it. Ooh. And think of it as like if you're out um, ice fishing or if for some hunters out there or if you go way up north just yeah. cabining or boating, you always have a hot dish. So it became a thing way back when, and now everyone brings it to every party. Sounds gross. Next Sounds one uh, is <laughs> lutefisk. What is lutefisk? So it's a white fish that is aged, and I believe it's aged in lye. And the, <laughs> it, it takes on a very, yes, grotesque <laughs> smell and taste. And I can say that, <laughs> having Scandinavian roots, and I can also tell you that um, I don't particularly like it, but when people like it, they absolutely love it. So do you- Am I'll I saying make, it correct? Lut lutefisk. Lutefisk. So I can actually make you hot dish with lutefisk in it. Ah, so the two can be combined. Lutefisk. Popular. No, I'm saying I'll make it for you. Oh, you will? Oh, bring if it in. If you want to try it. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I'm not going to waste Yeah, that. It's, it's gelatinous in texture. Name means live fish. Yes. Yeah. Cool. Uh, next, what is duck, duck, gray duck? Everyone knows what duck, duck, gray duck is because I that's that game do. you play as a kid. No, that's duck, duck, goose. That's there's how I no, know it. There's no such thing. Are you telling me that it's not Duck Duck Goose this whole time I've been lied to? So this is so funny because I, we were talking about childhood games yeah. and I said, well, Duck Duck Grey Duck. And I remember our producer Steve said, what in the world is that? And I go, oh, come on, you have to, you guys don't play that game here? No. And I explained it and he goes, wait a minute. We play Duck Duck it's Goose Duck here. Duck G well, Duck Duck Grey Goose? Oh, no, no that's, that's a vodka. That's the vodka. Uh, so those are your Minnesota <laughs> terms. Thank you, Misha, so much. So when you're yeah. watching the uh, Eagles and Vikings this I weekend, you'll know. I hope I clarified know. some stuff. Somewhat you did, yeah. <laughs> I want to play a I little. I want more questions. I want to play Duck Duck Grey Goose. Yeah, and you say so much and eat a hot dish. <laughs> yeah, you bring the hot dish, <laughs> you bring the Duck Duck Grey Goose, and everyone has a big blast. But I can tell you, Pat, I got to say, you got that accent down. Are you lying really? to me? Yeah. Do you no, Get the bro, Svenska. We must just say, yeah. <laughs> yeah, get the bro. That's, the bro. that's what I was going to say, but I didn't want to upstage you. Oh, no, you do a really good job, Pat.